Alright, how's it going folks? We're back to Final Fantasy VII. Haven't played this in a while, so uh, I thought that I could do a little marathon of it here. And basically, off cam, I got Alexander, which which is most likely going to help us since it is a very powerful, very, very powerful summon. It was quite easy. I had to resort to a fag, actually. That is uh, F-A-Q, not F-A-G. For those of you not in the know, there was a little cutscene when I stepped out of the shack for the first time, but um, nothing really major going on. And now we're gonna go take on the Great Glacier. Well, actually, didn't we just take that on? I don't know, but uh, we have to keep our temperature up, our body temperature, at around 38, 37. I always found this part very, very fun for some reason. I don't know why. Bec maybe it's because I've gotten used to cold. Still don't like it, but uh, yeah. And besides, the the temperature is in Celsius, not in Fahrenheit, which I also thought was pretty funny considering that this is the... Uh, well, I always had the... American version of the game, and I had a modded PS1, so <laughs> it was funny that they even had the Celsius in that version of the game, considering that Americans use, Americans use the Fahrenheit system. But yeah, basically, no, 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 no. I want to warm up a little bit first. So basically, at this point, you just tap it until you're at 38, and then you climb, rinse, and repeat. There's nothing. Nothing that special about this part. There's, uh, I think there's three, like, climbing parts, and then there's, uh, a couple of these. These, uh, cavern-type deals here. And basically there's usually some little, uh, what's it called? A puzzle in every one of them. And... The funny thing is that when you go outside in a cavern part, you can run into a Marlboro, Marlboro, whatever, whatever, whatever the fuck it's called. But we're gonna dispose of these enemies. I actually ended up leveling, leveling up quite a bit when I was getting Alexander. Well, trying to get Alexander. So, uh, both Cloud and. Barrett now have over 2,000 HP, which is going to be good since we're going to be taking on a boss in uh, at the end of the cavern part. Just before getting to the northern crater, we are going to be going against a boss that looks like, I guess he looks kind of like a dragon, but not really. It's kind of like a, like a like Puffy the Magic Dragon, or something like that. We're gonna get a javelin out from this chest, I believe. So it's really not even worth it. I'm not gonna be using Sid. Yes, remembered that correctly. That's awesome <laughs> that I remember stuff about a game that I played, like, last time I played, like, three years ago. More stupid enemies, and I probably forgot to... Equip Alexander. I'm probably gonna give it to Barrett since he's got the most en energy, not energy, but HP. So the HP drop that comes from that, it's probably minus five percent. It doesn't matter that much. This is probably gonna finish these guys off. And oh yes, the uh, the new video thing, unlimited video time. Uh, probably not, but. I'm probably gonna do use that with this and Minecraft the most, considering they're the most easiest to render out and upload. It doesn't take that long at all. This usually Final Fantasy videos takes takes like take like um should I say two minutes to upload? <laughs> Simply because the files are not that big. It doesn't take that much time to render them out either, like, 
10, 10, 20 minutes, so I'm probably going to end up making these the longest videos simply because of time issues. And there is a hair on my glasses. I'm trying to get it out. Aw, oh, shit. This could be very bad. Or not. We have... Oh! It, it's not going to be that bad, considering that we have uh, two limit breaks on the... On the conveyor belt. Ah, oh, shit, I should have done Flim Hazard. Well, that's my fault. Didn't die from that, it will die from this one, definitely. Look at that sword. Looks fucking awesome. <laughs> God, I love the design on that sword. I used to draw it in school all the time. When I was bored, I used to, like, draw so swords and shit. Thinking that I would be the next... Next great designer. Sword designer for... For Square Enix at the time, it was known as Square Enix. Where am I going? I'm going over here. Oh, there we go. But first, I was pretty lucky not to run into any random battles there because both Tifa and Cloud were pretty low on HP. We're gonna push the rock or kick it as he so elegantly did. And it's gonna roll down there, and take care of the ice, and then roll to the bottom of the green glowing spit down down there. <laughs> there it goes. Wee! A nice little sound effect. And we're gonna head back ourselves since the way is clear. Hopefully there won't be that many, that many battles. And uh, the reason why I, haven't play why I haven't been playing this is, well, first off, I'm trying to gl get Black Ops and Dead Rising 2 done. Uh, but the other reason is, like I said in the beginning, I am expecting this to be a very, very long Eternity project. Simply because it's a very long game. I remember my second playthrough took like 55 hours. <laughs> and my first one, well, it's... I still have the save and it's stopped at 99 hours and 59 minutes. But yeah, oh, one more thing, one more thing. I'm going to show you this. It seems that uh, Barrett has been the first one to get to level 3. And that is, uh, that is quite cool. It's a very powerful limit break to have at this point. I don't remember ever having a limit 3 this early. Though I could be wrong, but um, well, doesn't really matter. Anyways, the the uh the important part is that we have it, and we can abuse it. Not really, but still, it's it's very cool and a very powerful at at attacks. Like, I think it's six times. So I might get that up, that limit break bar up before the boss battle. This is gonna be a back attack. I hate these. Doesn't matter. Uh, let's throw a shrine here. Get rid of him quite quickly. Waiting for death to appear here. That is a very cool spell to have as well. Yeah, you really didn't stand any chance. Magic breath. Yes, you did it the cloud, didn't you? Oh, oh, it does it does it to everyone. Well, I'm so gonna get that, and I'm so gonna die. <laughs> Um, I need to do Comet. Wow, I'm actually... I'm very surprised. That did a lot of damage. That did a whole lot of damage. Unfortunately, Tifa, who I need to level up simply because she's far behind of the rest, died in that battle and didn't end up getting anything. That was, uh, that was quite the surprise. Not a very pleasant one, that, either. So, that sucks. That sucks. It always sucks to lose a character. Always sucks when they die. But once again, we are down... We are out of the cave. Funny how it's, like, cold outside. And then, when you go inside, it's even, like, more icier. Uh, I believe that it's over here that you need to go to get 
to the next cavern, I think. I always picked the wrong option here, and I think that I did that now. Fuck. You've got to be joking me. God damn it. Warm up, you idiot. And we are... We are gonna get a battle, apparently. We are not gonna climb down. Hopefully it's not a Mul Mulbro... Good. Don't want to deal with that dude right now. I think that normal attacks should take care of these. Toxic Barf doesn't matter. It's not gonna end up doing that much damage anyway. Oh, and it slows the character down. I was not aware of that. Only did 95. Are you kidding me? That doesn't even tickle. Alright, just, just finish it up. Come on. There we go. It didn't do any damage. Those, uh, those poisonings, that is. Never really cared for that anyways. If it did or did not. Like, getting a, getting poisoned in a battle. Don't really care about that shit. Can you just get on there, please? Thank you. It's pretty amazing that he can climb a vertical wall anyway. And we have to press down in order to move to the left. Go up. Go up. Come on. 35. And we're gonna get back up just in time for... Whoops. 34. Come on. There we go. It's not really that hard. They could have just left it out, but... It is... It is kind of kind of funny. Uh, why would I go back down? <laughs> why would you give me the option to go back down when I clearly want to go up? Can you get up? I should keep... No, wait. Where is it? This... Where is it? Can I not have it here? I guess not. I was trying to get the little pointer thing to work. The, uh, the hand arrow that... hand arrow. The hand and the pointy finger. Dead end. Fuck you. That shows where you are. That would have made it a lot easier if it would show the, uh, possible places where you can climb. Alright, get up. I think there's only two cavern parts. I could be wrong, but I I think there's only two cavern parts, and this is a long fucking climb. And after the uh, the caverns, the game is gonna get really really trippy. There's gonna be a lot of shit coming up that might not make sense to you, but it's Final Fantasy. That is to be expected. But it is like that. God, oh, I remember this. This is... This might be tough. This might be a little tough. So I'm probably... Yeah, I don't like those guys. Those little bouncy penguins. I don't like them. They do this little attack when they die. Sorry about that. Took a little sip of my drink. I found that uh, it's a lot easier to commentate when you drink regularly. Especially during recordings. Since that's what I was referring to. But uh, yeah, it keeps... Keeps my mouth hydrated, I guess. And uh, it's a lot easier to talk. They're most likely gonna die from this. And do their fucking... Yes, good. They didn't do it. Good. That is awesome. Now Tifa is gonna get a li Not a limit break, but a level... Oh. She already got it. Apparently. Well, two more kills towards Cloud's ne next... Limit break set. Which will be the third one. Which will be Media Rain. That is awesome. And I'm gonna use a tent here. I'm ru starting to run out of uh, MP a little. 
And we're gonna throw a save here for a good measure. So that if we do end up dying, which could be possible, I'll have a save right here. This is of course because there's those little there, there's those little holes on the ground and you need to basically drop shit on them so that you can god damn it make a way through and uh, of course there's a long ass way around which you need to take as you can see please not those idiots please not those good good I don't care I don't give a shit about you just not Marlboros. I hate those guys. There's always like ambushed or or whatever it is in the other Final Fantasy games, and then you know what's coming. Bad breath. It's like wash your teeth. You're disgusting. And then before you know it, you have your own teammates attacking you simply because bad breath causes. <gasps> oh, this is an extreme bomber. Thank you, sir. We got a counter there. <laughs> that is awesome. But yeah, bad breath causes a lot of status, status effects, including confusion, which is probably the most annoying one. Uh, what was I supposed to do? Heal Cloud. There we go. And we're all ready to go. I would love to be able to... Shit. Actually, we get a we get a new uh, sword for Cloud over here, and I don't remember if it was better than Organics. I hope not, since I would like to keep on using that. But what was I talking about before? Just confusion. Whatever, it doesn't matter. And as far as I can remember, the uh, the Cloud no, not the Cloud, but the sword was called. It wasn't Rune Blade. Rune Blade was the first cool-looking sword. But what was this one called? Um, I can't remember. Whatever. But yeah, I also cannot remember if it was better or not than the uh, than the sword that I have now, which 